That boy needs to learn to clean a good dish, leaving me with a stack of dishes. I know he loves chili dogs, but jeez, Sonic needs to learn to clean after himself. I did not raise that boy to be a pig. Anyway, I wonder when he's gonna be home. He said that we were gonna watch a movie tonight, or go out fishing. Think he'd be here? No, no. It's your friend. You should know him. He is us. He's your friend, too. He's us. What do you mean? Exactly. Something is somewhere. Sonic, you're home. Huh? You're home, boy. I've been waiting for you for hours. You left me with a stack of dishes, and I had to clean up after your chili dog mess. Also, who's your friend over there? Oh, guys. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, why are you gonna hide behind me? Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. Hold up. Look at him for a second. No, wait, look at him. Look at him for a second. Does he look like Sonic? You know. Uh, Does he... Is he just wearing a mustache? Well, Does of course I look... Look, of course I look like Sonic. I'm his uncle. Sonic, come on in. Come on. Been waiting for you for hours, I boy. Uncle? We we have an... Do I have an uncle? Huh? Do we have friends? Oh, so what? Uh, I, I noticed the new Whoa. sweater. Whoa. Uh, um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I've had this for a while. Oh, I don't recall seeing it in your closet. Hmm. Must be new and... Oh my, what happened to your ear? Uh, I, I've had that for like six years. I would have um, noticed if my nephew had a bite mark on his ear, or, or it's torn off, or... Nephew. What happened, Sonny? Uh, I, uh, I tore it off under a boulder six years ago. I, I'm sorry, who, who are you? Who am I? This is some Freaky Friday thing. I don't like this. This is so weird. Oh, so why is your friend phasing through the couch? Again, how did he see me? He's not. He's not modern. How can he see me? Oh, so hold weird. on, hold on. I'm sorry. I mistook you for my nephew. Uh, I, you're from another zone, aren't you? Uh. Yeah, I mean, I guess we are in my zone, are we? Yeah, I'm from a... Yeah, I'm from a different zone. You Hi. look so much like my nephew. <laughs> you are him. That's so weird. Like... Uh, so weird. Huh? I'm saying you're him, I can tell. The looks and everything. Yeah. <sighs> I mean... And you look like I a lot like him, too. I am from another zone. <laughs> are you from another zone? No, technically, yes, technically, no, I'm from him. This confuses this old geezer, <laughs> but I'll go with it. Yeah. So, uh, what brings you over by my house? Well, Modern said that we were going to go out for a run, and I haven't been able to find him for two hours. That boy's He's been gone for this. two hours as well. I had to clean up a whole bunch of dishes because he left me to do it after he ate a bunch of my chili dogs. Yeah, he hasn't yeah. been back I for a while. Dishes. And we were supposed to, And we were supposed to watch a movie and then go fishing. Macy's blown us off. Macy's blown us off. He's not here. What the heck? He's probably busy. Uh, uh, Wait, hey, hold on. Hey, calm hold on. down. He's probably busy. Hold on. Just give him yeah, a bit. Something came huh? up on my phone, doodad. Uh, this message from Sonic. Oh. Uh, Uncle, I... Uh, 
Uh, Sonny uh, says, uh, I won't be back for a couple of hours. If Maurice comes on by, tell him that I sadly won't be able to make it. Sorry to leave you both high and dry. Something important came up. See, I told you, you probably got into something. <laughs> hey, that's Makes my sense. that's my nephew. <laughs> well, I would since you both are Sonics, I guess you're also my nephews in a sense. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> Never had an uncle before. That's kind of kind of odd. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> allow allow me to introduce myself. You can either call me Sir Charles or just Charles or Chuck or Uncle Chuck, whatever you prefer. Uh, I'll call you Chuck. Charles reminds me too much of the old king before I had to take Wait, over. Charles, was he a hedgehog? Uh, I think so. I never really met him directly. Did you ever see pictures of him? I've seen old pictures of him in the castle. Does he look like me? Actually, come to think of it, just a little, yeah. Then you got your answer, Sonny. You had your own uncle. Well, if he's still around. Oh, uh, before I had to, I mean, I had to take over because the guy died of some terminal illness. Ah. Uh, well, may he rest in peace. But, yeah. I guess since Sonic's not gonna be here for a while, I guess I got nobody else to be with. Been trying to hang out I with mean, the boy for the longest. I mean, we could hang out if you want. I, I don't want to leave somebody just hanging. Feels kind of dickish, you know. Well, well, for one, that goes to the swear jar. Dang it! <laughs> <laughs> I bet you have a swear jar too, Mister. I had one. It's not existent anymore. Still had anymore. one. No, it's yours. It's yours too. <laughs> Damn it! It's just so off always <laughs> seeing other versions of Sonic. I have never met any other versions of me, but... <laughs> it amuses me. I just know I have more nephews out there in the multiverse. <laughs> <It's so laughs> <me. laughs> hey, I'm still getting used to it myself. How do you think it feels seeing a younger one of me running around me all the time? Well, it's only because I'm younger. <laughs> it's as you crazy as the me. time I heard Sonic Time Travel yeah. and met his younger self. <laughs> I mean, technically, he is my younger self in a sense, but not exactly. I guess you could say that. Oh, wait a minute. In a sense. From what I can tell of the look of you, I've done my research, I'm a scientist myself. Um. You are? Yes. We're a bit of a scientist ourselves, too. I'm a bit of a scientist myself. But... Oh, I can tell from the effects of your world, you had a Genesis wave. Sorry, but I know those are harsh to bring up. I didn't mean to upset you. <laughs> but... No, you're fine. Hmm. Which is a constant reminder since the only other thing we can call myself is that one. Because we both share the same name. Yeah. So, do you go by we'll Sonic? Come up with something better eventually. Uh, yeah. yeah. Well, my full name is Ogilvy. Ogilvy Frenegade Maurice, <laughs> but everybody refers to me as either Sonic or. Maurice around here because apparently, you know, Modern also goes by Sonic, so it gets more confusing, and I'd rather not be called my zone name because that's just weird. So we just went by my la we just went by my last name instead, because that'll be easier. And I share the exact same thing. Oh oh oh, 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 o
I still haven't met my dad. Hmm. Have you not met your your family, Sonny? <laughs> um, I mean, I met my biological mother once, like last <laughs> month. You have a mom too. I met her last month. I didn't even know she existed until a month ago. <laughs> and she was a robot. It was so weird in the world. Oh, she went through robot. roboticization. I, yeah, apparently. I am still very confused a little because, I mean, I grew up with my. Uh, it, I now apparently learned as my step parents, but, you know. It's still Wait. kind of odd. We could talk and get to that concept. We could talk and get to know each other a little bit more. I will be preparing uh, stuff to go fishing if you want to go with me. Hey, I wouldn't mind. I mean, fishing? I haven't went doing that in a while, so. I used to go fishing with Sonic ever since he was a babe. Well, n near a baby. I had him with a little toy fishing rod. <laughs> <laughs> Aw, that's cute. Yeah. He enjoyed fishing ever since he was little. He barely ever goes fishing <laughs> with me anymore, so... Got no one else to go fishing with. Well, I mean... I mean, that's typical teenagers. They're just... Think that they can't stand still for one second and always want to run around. I was like that once, so I get that. Hmm. You still do. Wait, how... what? How old are you, Sonny? I'm 23. Oh... Now I feel older. <laughs> I just don't sound like it because I got in a pretty bad fight that messed up my throat, so now I just permanently sound like a younger kid. <laughs> well, it makes yeah, you sound adorable, like Sonny. <laughs> hey! No, not you too! <laughs> <laughs> I can head pat my. Hey, you get the head pats just like Sonic does. <laughs> and you squirm First, like him too when he gets annoyed by him. <laughs> First Yoshi, then Rosalina, then you, then Modern. What's next? <laughs> <laughs> you two. Uh, I can't escape. Don't jinx it. It might get worse. I'm not. Because right. I know that you're going to make it worse if I do. Well, I just. <laughs> since I got done cleaning dishes, I'm going to uh -huh. head downstairs to the basement and grab the fishing rods so we can get prepared. Oh, oh sure. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I have to go look down there through all Sonic stuff to find him. So I still hope he has a smishing rod down there that you can borrow. Huh. What type uh, of fishing rod is it? It's the old timey stuff. Oh, that type of stuff. <laughs> yes. Huh. I remember Yoshiro having, or well, Dad having one a while ago, so... Back in the day, me and Sonic's father used to go fishing a lot. <laughs> hmm. I mean, me and uh, me and Dad used to do that occasionally. <laughs> but it was uh, it was uh, there was the occasional time where he that uh, the fishing trips was actually a disguise of him trying to teach me how to swim. Hmm. I don't like those days. <laughs> Well, anyway, I'm gonna go grab them and stop lollygagging so we can move fast, because knowing Sonics, they like to move fast. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. I'm gonna head downstairs. You, to you boys, wait here. All right, catch you later. Or in a so bit. Weird. All right, finally made it. But who else is we've been to this area? <laughs> oh, never seen this part of. This looks familiar. I've never seen this place before. Yeah, it's a little actually... old fishing pond. I have all my stuff set up here. I brought Sonic here every other uh, part of the year when he was way younger. Huh. It's really shallow. Hmm. Should be able cool. to get a good few bites, but we could also talk and get to know each other Whoa. more. Hey, I wouldn't mind that. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh. that's right. Come on, you old girl. There we go. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Just have to wait for a few bites. Okay. Yeah. So. 
Do you at least have any brothers or sisters like Sonic does? Well, I mean, I do have my brother Yoshi. Hmm. Yoshi, wait. You mean those dinosaurs from that island? <laughs> yeah! Hmm. You good, bro? Yeah. Okay. I gotta lift this one up. <laughs> Nothing coming yet. This place feels familiar for me for some reason. I don't know oh, why. Look at being here. Is it coming up? Yep, I feel mm -hmm. one. But one's not wanting to take the bite. Hey. Hmm. Alright. Mm -hmm. Was out. Neat. Huh? There he is. Ah. <laughs> it's about to be morning <laughs> soon. Oh, wow. Well. Wait, have we been out that late? Yeah. We've been walking for yeah, a while. Sleep. My perception on time is messed up. <laughs> That's what you get for not sleeping. It amazes me that you still haven't met your version of, well, your family. Well. Uh, are we supposed to? Well, I have one question. Do you know if you do have any siblings? Blood related? I... I recall... Uh... Her... Whenever we were talking last month for the first time, I do recall her saying something about siblings. I've never met them or known anything about them. I don't even know if they exist. If they're Hold on. You know, all around. This pool is broken. Eh, I'll get oh. another one. This one's not oh, running to work. Dang. We did bring in a lot. Yep, we brought in a lot. All right, there we go. We new. And oh. <laughs> Whoa! That's a Come lot on. better of a throw. Yeah! <laughs> this old hey, man still has it! <laughs> Apparently! I don't got it. <laughs> so, since you. I can't get it. So, what was your mother's name in your world? Apparently, she introduced herself as. Uh, wait, which mother are you talking about, actually? Well, blood related. Uh. She apparently introduced herself as Athena. Different from the one I know. We have it here, we call her Alina. Huh. I think I recall Modern talking about her once. Yeah. She sounded nice. She is the best woman I know in the whole world. She actually helped me and, well, my brother during when we were in a tough time. Oh. Uh, what the what tough time? Well... Yeah, I'm kinda curious about that. <laughs> it's an old story, hope you're ready to hear it. Oh, yeah. Trust me, I've got, ton of, I've got tons of time. <laughs> well... There's no such thing as time for me. <laughs> back in our old days... <laughs> it reminds me of just yesterday, but... I, well, obviously am the older brother to my younger brother. We actually didn't have the normal living life most people had. Yes, we actually were on the streets. Oh, so kind of like Genesis. For a good while, yeah. me and Jules had to survive on our own because our father left our mother. And I was the only oh. one to take care of Jules when he was, well, a baby. Her mother died giving birth to him, but I didn't ever tell him that. Don't want to hurt him. Oh. Hmm. Yeah. But. That makes sense. She was a nice woman. Took care of us while she could. 
And then for a good while, let's just say, they threw us out to the streets, and we survived on our own, until one day, one day Jules met a little girl, and that little girl was Alita. She was actually pretending to be, well, <laughs> homeless for a good while. <laughs> she was part of this royal family that was, as Sonic says nowadays, preppy and richy. She was part of this family that she necessarily had trouble with some time to time. Her father was a nice man, but her mother, on the other hand, was something else. For a good while, when she would come to visit Jules, she would come and play with him and be friends. I would watch over the two as they played and try to make as much money and get as much food as we could. Till one day, her mother and father found out she was pretending to be homeless on the streets. And actually offered us the best deal that helped us. They took me and Jules in. As well, long as we... Them. As long as we lifted our weight around the house. Well, yeah, no one likes a freeloader. <laughs> from what I always remember from what my mother used to say... Don't be a couch potato. Work hard, <laughs> and you, you'll get to the goals in life. Oh, well, I know one or two things about working hard, that's for sure. <clears throat> and then, being, being... when Jules became a teenager, that's right around when, well, <laughs> the boy was developing feelings. Oh, that's cute. And he learned that, well, Helena had magical powers, and they went on adventures with each other. I would go on the adventures with them. We went on so many adventures with each other, all three of us. Huh. Helena got well known as, well, the hero of Mobius. Alongside with Jules, the fastest thing alive. For his time. Huh. I remember reading something about something similar to that before. During a time, <laughs> let, let's just say, Alina and him got serious, and, well, they decided to finally settle down with each other. They wanted children. Hmm. And that's when the triplets were born. <laughs> Sonic, Manic, and Sonia. Well, Sonic didn't go by Sonic at the time. He went by Ogilvy Maurice. <laughs> I still remember the day when I was <laughs> still in the hospital with Jules waiting. He was scared, nervous, as any father would be. And he was wondering yeah. what he was going to name the boys. I suggested many other names, and then he looked at his hair product and said, I'm going to name my son Ogilvy. Oh, jeez. wonder if my dad was like that. He's yeah, curious. Let's say Jules cared a lot about his hair. He was huh. one of the... He was not so... the brightest crown in the box when he was younger. Well, I guess that makes sense. Not everybody's the smartest as a kid. Alright. Gotta move this in. Is that an important name? I don't know. Maybe yeah. I, I guess I can reason? place this down until we oh, uh, get any bites. I'm gonna take a drink. That makes sense. What kind of drink is it? Chaos Cola. Cola? Hey, yo, I like pop. <laughs> but yes, when Sonic basically was born and his brother and sister. Lena had an old enemy back in the day. Somebody from my college. Who is that? Julian Ivo Robotnik. Wait. Wait a minute. His real name is Julian? Yes. We used to call him Jewel. I love that. I am forever going to hold that over his head. 
Julian was the odd kid of the bunch. He hated everybody else for some reason, and kind of kept his distance. Huh. I tried befriending him, and, well, he tried to bully me at uh, college. Sounds typical. But I put him in his place. Whoa. <laughs> Makes sense. And then he basically was planning on machines, putting them into, putting animals in machines and doing all sorts of crazy stuff. <laughs> Starting up his evil plans. I reported him and got him kicked out of college yeah, and fine. well, he had a huge hatred towards me and also the king of the acorn family. Huh. Me and the king of the acorn family. Don't have exactly the uh, best relationship with each other. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I remember it's Sonic used to date their man. daughter. <laughs> they were a thing I... back then. Uh, me and Sally were also a thing back then before uh, we broke up on good ties. Things weren't going out well between the two of us. Not only that, but her brother kind of creeps me out because he kept trying to hook up with me, and that was really weird, so... Ah. Well... Yeah. In Sonic's scenario, it didn't end well, but... That's... But back to the main premise of the story. Julian basically wanted revenge on Alina. And a prophecy by a fortune teller told him that he was going to be defeated by three triplets on his conquest Ooh. for evil. He didn't like that and tried hunting down Alina and her family. Oh. She had to basically separate Sonic and, well, Manic and Sonia. I raised Sonic myself. Huh. Jules wasn't around at the time because him and Alina had a big fight back then. It didn't go well. Oh, so they got a divorce? Not necessarily. They were never married. They never got the chance to. Oh. Huh. Let's say one night he got reckless and... did something he wasn't ready for, and let's just say Alina was pregnant. <laughs> oh, lovely. That's... <laughs> you Is okay, your friend buddy? okay there? <laughs> Sonny. Hey, Sonny. Hey. Yeah. You can have some of my He's chaos. a little sensitive on the talk of the duck. I can't really drink it, but thanks for the gesture. If you want, I could give you a hug. Well, you might face through me, but... You want a hug? It's a thought that counts. Hey. There's nothing better than a hug from your family member. Even though you might not be able to feel me. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> He's a little sensitive on his talk with the duck. He won't open up too much about it, but... Some stuff happened between the two that weren't... Good memories, I'll say that. Understandable. I don't have that many fond Hi. memories between me and him, but... Let's say... Um, from... To continue the story. So, Sonic, after a while, was learning his speed, and I had to be the only one there to teach him and keep him a secret, because Robotnik oh. would have figured it out. And him and the Acorn family were kind of going at war. Huh. Most of my speed was self-taught. Though I was occasions where me and Yoshi would train with each other and Yoshiro would teach me a lot. I know that Yoshiro used to fight uh, the doc all the time. <laughs> In fact, it used to be his job before it ended up becoming my job because he kept trying to steal all the resources off the island. <laughs> and he wasn't having it. Though he still does have my, his little rules that I had to follow. 
Well, that's supposed to actually go into the doc's lab, but I don't follow that sometimes. It's still gotta do anyway, just because sometimes I gotta save prisoners and I have to go in there. Interesting. He just kinda puts that law down because he's worried about me getting hurt, that's all. As of any he family member, we always look out for he... each other. Yeah. He always says that he doesn't want me falling the same way one of his friends did back in the past. Hmm. Apparently one of his friends, Scott, died from being turned into a robot too, so... He's always worried about the same thing happening to us. I know my fair share. When Robotnik took over for a good while, he roboticized me first. Huh? Right in front of Sonic. For a good while, Sonic had to basically join the Freedom Fighters and try to free me. Roboticization is not a fun thing, but I was able to fight back and gain my memory back, but not my body. Oh. I've had something similar, but that was with Sally. From then I mean... on forward, Sonic continued his adventures, and I tried helping him as much as I could. Now he's a big boy, and <laughs> he's doing good. I'm proud of him. Just like that's how I'm good. proud of any other Sonic that's doing good. Like you, and you too. Wait, you're proud of me? From what I'm hearing of the story so far, and now you're grown. <laughs> I'm proud of any Sonic. Yeah. You're all my nephews. Oh my Man, there's family. a lot that I had. There's a lot I had to deal with. A lot he's had to deal with too. But you pulled through. You're still here. Yeah. Pulling through an apocalypse isn't easy. I think I remember Sonic mentioning an apocalypse. Yeah. It was a thing. It was like a massive apocalypse that had lasted over six years, actually. So I spent most of my teenage years doing. I was 17, turning 18, uh, and uh, Darkon, Gleam, and Taboo attacked, and some of us survived, but a lot of us didn't, and we had to kind of pull through until we finally were able to defeat them. And you still did it. <laughs> That's the one thing I always yeah. admire, that you... And the rest of the other Sonics, fully... from what I've heard, are still heroes yeah. still to your heart. And you're willing to do anything yeah. to help anyone. Or even stop any evil to... that comes its way. Yeah. I mean, sh I was able to help everyone get what they... Uh, to get everybody back. I mean, I didn't get who I wanted back in the end, but... It's the, it's the fact that everybody else got what they wanted that's what counts and that's what's and good what i actually noticed something is that a plushie of amy rose oh uh yeah yeah it is it so i i keep it as a mem uh, memorial a memorial sonic told me yeah. about what happened He talks yeah. about some of the other Sonics he hangs out with. He talks very highly of you guys. It's like he has a bunch <laughs> of brothers. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I do occasionally look at him like a brother. People usually say that me and him could be twins, which is funny, because I'm older. <laughs> <laughs> well, since no bites are coming up, and nothing's coming... How about we go home and watch that movie that we were supposed- well, me and Sonic were supposed to. <laughs> what kind of movie is it? Oh, it's, uh, more of the horror genre. No vampires. I don't like them either. Thank you, somebody who gets it! Hey, buddy. Buddy. <laughs> buddy. Yeah. Movie? Yeah. Sure. Hey. I might I as well join in with this one. <laughs> hey. 
Actually, well, now that I think about okay. it, if you did have symptoms, <clears throat> where's your medallion? Wait, what medallion? Eh? Hmm. That's not <clears throat> hard. You're supposed to have a medallion. Unless you probably don't in your universe. Um, medallion? What? Oh, that's a little detail I forgot to left out. How Sonic met his siblings is, well, he had a magical medallion thanks to Alina passing her magic on to, well, three majestical medallions that would connect the siblings together if they were ever separated. Sonic had a guitar, Sonia had a piano, and Manic the drums. I'm surprised huh. you didn't have one. I don't remember ever hearing about them. I never had one to begin with. I think I remember Dad once talking about a serious cloaked guy once coming to his door, but I don't remember anything about... Huh. Well, I could show you Sonic's medallion at home. Sure. See if it can... I mean, it'd be weird if I had a guitar, because I only... Like, sure, I can play a little bit of normal stringed guitar, but I'm I'm more of a piano player. Hmm. I'd be more of the drums. Usually, from what Alina said when the kids were born, they would basically act like they were playing the instruments in their sleep. Sonic would be playing a guitar like he was, well, at a concert when he was a baby. He would be doing this all the whole time. And he was <laughs> destined to have the guitar medallion. So maybe you have the piano huh. one. There's a piano one? Oh wait, yeah, I rem Yeah, you said that earlier. Jeez, my memory's getting really fuzzy. Well, <laughs> let's get going. Uh, I'll come what about back the other up. stuff? Yeah, I'll have my uh, friend come up and clean it up. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess I'll take this on the go. I might as well take mine with me. Come on, boys! <laughs> let's go home! Come on, buddy! Let's go! Nah, let's go.